Ned Shaper's World of Beveldom is the greatest comeback story ever told. The things that used to be treated as mankind's junk now finds new life and rules the world. The mad daddy who thought about things he didn't have to. An unlucky god. Very lucky to be here. But really, the characters and the story are a way for Ned to present his own beliefs, values, and his feelings about our consumer culture. Hello, I'm General Lee speaking, Curator General of the Museum of Kinetic Art. The Museum of Kinetic Art was founded on the principles of available resource technology. Since the beginning, objects that had lost their way found their way to our doorstep and were given a new life in theater as characters, costumes, and instruments of the Matt Bevel philosophy. And you can express what has meaning to you in your world story, too. Ned Shaper began telling his story in the mid-80s while wearing his artwork on the streets of New York City. As a street performer, he would wear a propeller helmet and a strange musical contraption. I didn't realize I was on the other side of the street. Just stepping up the security, ma'am. This gave him the opportunity to develop his story with an audience and watch people's reaction to his creations. Today, we want to stress the importance of how to tell a great story. And give it up for the new non Thank you. We're going to bring together meaningful elements of your world using what you've created through your doodles, your headgear, and now your story. We're going to help you refine, organize, and present your original ideas in a storyboard so you can communicate what's meaningful to you. What's the story in your world? Is yours a comeback story? Is it a quest? Are you seeking justice? What is the tone? Is it lighthearted or dark? And, as the final part of the universe within, we'd like you to get into character, step into your world, and take the show on the road in a pedestrian carnival. Wearing your sculptural headgear and other costumes and accessories that you'd like to wear, you're going to visually project your story. I'm a rabbit in my world. My world's made out of trees and plants and carrots. So the name of my world is Yamber. It's made of all my favorite foods, candy, and earth materials. My world is about baseball. Everything's made out of baseball bats. My name is Day and Night. My place, my world, is Candyland. It's made completely out of candy and sugar stuff. The name of my world is Lil Toes World, and it's made of gold, diamond, money, and rainbows. And characters that live there are Spongebob, Shrek, Lil Pump, and Ric Flair. Teachers and the student body will see your creativity and original ideas in action. And you'll get to see their response to what you've created. Remember, the main thing is that when you wear your headgear, you step into the universe within. It gives you the power to share with so many others the strength of your imagination. Now get out there and show them what you got.